Hi, I'm Peter Lupus, and welcome to Live It Up. All the jobs I've had, the best job I ever had was with you when we did the Love Boat, oh. and they paid us to go on a cruise. It was great. Wasn't remember? that fantastic? <laughs> I remember you asked my wife Sharon and I to go, and you didn't take Patty. He said, I want to find a surprise for yes. her. Yes. And, and he found this gorgeous emerald ring with a diamond in the center. So we went back to the Love Boat, yeah. and we had the captain's table, and we had something to eat that night. Right. And you pulled that ring out. It was I didn't know it was this... 25th wedding anniversary. That was the 25th. Now, that was April 25th. And now April 25th will be my 54th. So that was 29 oh years ago. Gosh. Oh, my, oh my gosh. gosh. <laughs> <laughs> you mean you were making more than the ball players? Oh, yes. And one of them asked me for $200. Oh, my God. <laughs> Different ball game now, isn't it? Yeah, yeah right. <laughs> Fantastic. You know, he used to come into Mission Impossible. Nobody ever knew even how tall he was going to be. He'd come in as a different character. I remember one day, Greg and I, I said, Greg, Greg said, uh, I'm taller than Marty. I said, you're not taller than Marty at all. And he was like 6'2". I said, Marty, win me $20. Come over here and stand up straight for Marty. And Marty goes. <laughs> and he was that much taller than Greg Morris. When he, he came out of his body and kept going. It, it's, it's kind of interesting. When I did Tucker, Francis Coppola directed that, and Jeff yep. Bridges did the lead. And Francis said to me, you know, I see Abe is shorter. He said, because you're the same height as Jeff Bridges. I said, uh-huh. He said, I also say Abe is older. You have more, you're, you're more youthful. I said, well, don't worry about it. I said, we're having a week's rehearsal, right? He said, yeah. I said, don't worry about it. Every day in rehearsal, I got a little older and a little shorter. <laughs> I was good at I don't know how you do it. That, that was a great I'm the incredible you. shrinking man. <laughs> you raise slowly. You right. You don't grab that. No, you're fine. You raise slowly. You no, no. Raise slowly your right hand, uh, okay. and you address the ball. Salute la pelota. <laughs> Salute the ball. Salute the, the ball. That's yeah. it. That's the whole thing. You mean that's a lesson? That's it. Nothing else. Nothing else. <laughs> hey, hey, come on. Water. You gotta put the water. I'm not paying $55 for it. Salute the ball. I'll pay more. <laughs> <laughs> Salute la pelota. Well, Pat, Guido, I got to tell you, it was a ball having you. You can bring your golf club anytime you want, and I hope you'll come back. Am I back. done? <laughs> <laughs> That's it? You're not done, but I am. <laughs> <laughs> we'll be right back. Let Let's, me put one of mine in there. Oh, and we want all of yours in there. <laughs> Here, put a few more handful in there. Come on. All let that, them add it in. All that work, I ought to get a little good. There. there you go. I'm going to let you stay with Gina and actually work on the stove with her. And Gabrielle. for good luck. <laughs> I do. I, I, I may follow that. Sharon keeps talking to me. We have these long talks all the time, but it's mostly about her slowing down on her charge cards. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, you no. were on the cover of Time magazine. Yes. Yeah. Uh, editors of Time photographed every soap opera that was on the air at that time, and then sort of held the story because it was a cultural story rather than a hot news story. Mm -hmm. How many right. times does that happen in your life, you know? Yeah, yeah. right. Be on time, yeah. time cover. Magazine. Yeah, yeah. to be there. Very often. Usually you have to invade a country or kill somebody. <laughs> yes. Do you remember when I was How could you I escape? forget? How <laughs> could I forget? We had a scene where I had to help her escape from these bad guys, and we had to go up like a 30-foot chimney. Yes. And they had a, a, a rope that I had a, a button on that would take us up, mm -hmm. and I put you in the first strap, and I took her up about yeah. 15 feet. Then I got in the strap, and we went up. We had to be up 25 or 30 feet. Easily. That chimney actually Easily. was about 50 feet. Yeah. And I felt the rope give a little bit, mm -hmm. and I know... You probably just did a, too. Just a little bit, well, and it then broke. it broke. And I fell down to the bottom of this chimney, oh, and they, and and they had I a fell fire down there. And I fell on top of Peter, and he <laughs> saved my life. <laughs> she fell right on, honest, right on top of me. Honest to goodness, me. yes. Do you know that's the closest I've ever been to a Miss America? Ah, <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yeah. You know that if it hadn't been so painful, I'd still be holding on to you. <laughs> Any famous people here? I said two legends. 
She said, who? I said, Shirley Temple and A.C. Lyles. <laughs> <laughs> fantastic, fantastic. Okay, you? thank you. Okay. Cheers, ladies and gentlemen. I'll have some too. Well, I'll tell you, it's not the tastiest thing in the world, but I know it's good for you. <laughs> I can't really get my lips apart. <laughs> but I got to tell you something, Gideon. It may not taste good, and there's a lot of things I taste that I take that don't taste quite so good, but I happen to know this is excellent for you. So and it I'm going to go ahead and drink the rest of it anyway. Peter, a trooper. <laughs> oh, whoa, was that good for me? <laughs> Man, that, that does taste very good. Yeah, so this is a good I hope for I don't it. lose my nose on this. <laughs> Man, that is something. Lordy, I just lost my billfold. <laughs> wow, that's great. Fantastic. You know, that's making me flex my body. Yeah, I hate to tell you this, but we have to say goodbye. <laughs> and I don't know how I'm going to get off this machine, folks, but stick around. <laughs> I hope you read the fine print in your contract. This is no contact. <laughs> we're not contacting each other. We're just going to demonstrate. No contact. <laughs> How about that, folks? The point is, think young, have fun, and live it up. I'll see you again tomorrow.